Hello. Are you sick? Do you have a disease? Are you in pain? Are you suffering? Do you want hope? Well, do I have good news for you? Because Jesus is the great physician. He can heal the world. And this world is sick and in need of a great physician. We are creatures. He is the creator. We need to get to know our creator in order for us to know our purpose, in order for us to have truth and understanding in this world. If you don't, then you really won't know your purpose, only what you think it is in your own mind. Um, and you can come up with all your own ideas, but because human beings are fallible, we are bound to make mistakes, errors, faulty reasoning, and of course, that is not going to help us in our conquest to become healthier. So we need to seek out the great physician, and not just any physician. This is the great physician. This is God himself. All-powerful, all-knowing, omniscient, omnipotent. This is the great physician. And unlike other physicians that would want to treat you with drugs, this physician is going to treat you at the core of your very being. This physician wants to make you right before God, to cleanse you from your sins, and he also has compassion on those who are physically sick and wants to heal them. But we need to have faith that he can. We need to trust him and not lean onto our own understanding, but always lean onto God. Because God's ways are much higher than our ways. And obviously a creator is always going to be higher than his creation. Just as if I made Pinocchio, I would have been higher than Pinocchio. And imagine what it would be like if Pinocchio didn't know his creator. If Pinocchio didn't know why he was made, what his purpose was for being made, and what or where he was going to go when he died. These are very important questions and only the great physician can answer them and help you. So, I want to go over a verse in Psalms 103.3 which reads, Who forgives all your iniquities, who heals all your diseases. The great physician, Jesus, can forgive you of your sins, make you right before God so that you have eternity in heaven, but he also promises that he can heal you of all your diseases. And you need to believe and trust that. Now, of course, you can't just leave everything up, you know, and just pray a simple prayer and expect to be miraculously cured. Granted, I'm sure sometimes that happens, but we also need to take responsibility for our life as well. And God's given us rules and principles in his word, which if we were to live by, would enable us to be healthy just as he wills for us. Because God wills for each and every one of us to be healthy physically as well as spiritually. That is one of the wills for our life. So, Knowing that, um, many people will run to the doctor 
for their illness, but how often do we run to the great physician when we are sick? How dependent are we on the great physician in times of need, in times of help? And so, in my opinion, it is much wiser for us to go to the great physician when we are sick. Because he deals with our issues at the very root of the problem. Whereas a normal doctor is going to treat the symptoms and not address you as a whole and ultimately a regular doctor is fallible so they're able to make mistakes they don't have full understanding full knowledge so their guess is as good as anyone else um, ultimately they don't always give people hope but rather a death sentence unfortunately to many cancer victims but Jesus wants to give you hope he's the ultimate hope for any of us if any of us are to get well to get healthy to get saved from our sin Jesus is our hope and it says right there in Psalms 103.3 who heals all diseases not just some not just the little ones not just the big ones but all diseases Jesus has that power to heal all diseases because he understands us because he created us see So we need to seek Him and ask Him, pray to Him to heal us of our diseases. You know, a simple prayer would be, Dear Lord, I believe that You are the great physician and I trust You with my whole life and I believe that you can heal me from any afflictions that I have I am willing to let you reveal yourself to me to show me your truth so that you can open my mind and make me willing to want to serve you to want to live righteous, to want to eat healthy foods so that I may be able to overcome any of the diseases that I have. Thank you. Amen. So when we're sick, instead of running to a doctor who oftentimes is just as sick as the patient who doesn't really have a full understanding of treating the root cause of the problem why not run to the great physician and that is my message for today